All right, today I want to go over a couple of trades I made. And uh, today was a frustrating day to start because I actually wanted to take this MU trade long around this 4260 level. But uh, CMEG today sent a message out saying that, um, basically implying that some of my hotkeys, a setting needed to be changed, but I didn't understand the message. So uh, I actually tried to go long here and was re my order was rejected. And I had to contact the customer support and figure out how to change the settings. Uh, so that was a frustrating start because then, of course, as you can see, MU went on to go on a wild ride and I missed it. So I was a little frustrated, but I'm glad I didn't let that get to me too much. Now, on to the trades I did make. The first one was here on American Airlines. So I it looked really strong, came up off VWAP well. I had just got my settings changed, so I was finally able to trade. I went long here. Uh, I had this 33.51 level from uh, a daily level, so I took my first 50% partial there. I took another one here, and so I have 25% of my position left at this point, and I was holding out. This orange line right here, for me, is the 200 MA on the daily. And so I felt really confident. So I actually had a limit order set for um, 33.75. And um, we never quite made it. So uh, I, I got out here at about break even. I kicked myself at this last partial a little bit because I meant to get out if it dipped below 33.50. I told myself I was going to get out and then I disobeyed that. And I, you know, I waited too long. So I left some profits on the table there, but overall, this is a really nice trade for me. All right, and then I made another trade, and I'm gonna show you guys, actually I made two trades on MU. So although, again, I missed, I missed this trade on the upside, so, but I did take it to the short side, and it's a little confusing on the, uh, on the five minute chart here. So let me show you guys on the one minute what happened here all right so after it went up I went ahead and took it short here and um, for VWAP but then uh, it kind of turned on me and I got really scared about getting short squeezed so I stopped out there but I'm proud I got back in short here Took it down, took my first partial around the 4350 because I was worried about that being good. Uh, you know, I was worried that that might be support. And I kind of held there for a bit, dropped down some more, took another one. So now I have 25% of my position left. And at this point, I was sitting pretty on the day. So I took my last one here a little before we VAP, but I didn't know if it was going to make it or if it was just going to bounce off this 50MA. So all out right there. So all in. I had three trades today, two winners, and one stop out. Two winners. And uh, one stop out, which is this first MU trade. I feel really good about my day considering it started frustrating that I missed uh, that big MU move. Um, but happy with my recovery there. And um, really liked you know, overall the way I traded, although I think I left some money on the table with American Airlines on that last partial. But that was my day. Um, I reached my daily goal of 1% of count equity. I actually went over that. So solid day. Hope you guys traded well as well, and I'll see you guys in the chat tomorrow. <laughs>